Now, the country's first unit for patients with sickle cell disease has opened in the northwest in a bid to speed up access to treatment. The site at Manchester Royal Infirmary will treat people from Greater Manchester, Lancashire and Cumbria, as Lindsay Prosser now reports. As a child, Kena Ball learned to live with sickle cell disease. I had a lot of like pain in my ankles and in all my joints and when I was young I didn't really understand it fully. It was just kind of meant I missed out on some things like playtime. If it was raining at school I'd be inside. So this is our sickle cell unit. Okay. There is a doctor's office right there. Oh, hi. Hi, Jen. Today, Kane is visiting uh, Manchester Royal Infirmary's new sickle cell disease unit, which will care for those who have the condition. I think sometimes when you go to A&E and you're in so much stress and you're around a bunch of other people who don't understand you, a bunch of, like, medical professionals who don't understand you, everything's heightened and just like that, your condition gets worse. You've gone from, like, a 4 to level 10 in pain. So I think when you're here, you're around familiar faces and you're around people that you know are going to look after you. So how are you feeling today, Salam? Yeah, I'm better. Excellent. Are you still Salam is being treated for a sickle cell crisis. I feel like they understand the pain, so they try their best to ensure you're comfortable. Yeah. The disease is particularly common in people with an African or Caribbean family background. Crescent-shaped red blood cells can block blood vessels. The condition is a serious and lifelong disease, although treatment can help manage many of the symptoms. And uh, I feel better. So a sickle cell crisis can cause extreme pain and result in complications as well. So it's really important that patients get the right treatment urgently to prevent any complications. The sickle cell guidelines nationally say that sickle cell patients should receive analgesia within 30 minutes. So knowing that this will happen will definitely make a huge impact to them. Patients in crisis can call the unit where they're triaged and treatment starts immediately. Side rooms. Are they both side rooms? They're both side rooms. So this bit just for sickle cell then? Just for sickle cell. Literally just phone, come here, get a bit of stronger medicine or a place to rest and then probably be on my way because at the end of the day, like, I do still have a life to live. The unit will treat patients from Greater Manchester, Lancashire and Cumbria. Lindsay Prosser, BBC Northwest Tonight, Manchester Royal Infirmary.